if you think about it, you're, you're, you have a child's life in your hands. They're totally dependent on you. Too many of our children come from home environments where th there's not a lot of parental support. There may be no parental support. They may indeed be homeless. But you're still responsible for doing the very best you can for them. And to, to give you an example of they may be homeless, I have a young man who attended my high school. He was, he was homeless in high school. Well, he's working for Goldman Sachs now, so you can call it any way you want to. He works for Goldman Sachs. That's something to look, look at. Yeah, and, and, and Donald's right again. We, we feed a million meals a year. We, we, we clothe yeah. both uniforms and non-uniforms. Yeah. We, we provide transportation, buses and bus tokens and passes for subways. We, everything Donald says, we do. We all do, not just the yes. two of us, but that's part of the, I suspect that's part of the, what everybody does. But Donald's also right that we have to make sure we remember why we're there to develop the child's capacity to com be competitive on the world stage. Part of that is academics, but part of that is a self-esteem issue. Part of that is a view mm -hmm. of the world that's bigger than self. Uh, so there's a lot of aspects to what that final product looks like. 